Only 2.5% of all water on Earth is fresh water, but most of that is trapped in the ice caps and only 0.8% is available for drinking as groundwater or surface water. Luckily for Guelph, we live on an Amble and Arkell aquifer, which provide residents with clean drinking water delivered straight to your tap for less than a hundredth of a cent per liter. The UN declares water as an integral human right. Bottled water presents a social problem in that it is privatizing this human right. Corporations are bottling up and profiting from something that should be accessible and affordable. Many of these corporations get this water from the same source as a municipal tap water and simply sell it back to us. Here's the real question. Are single-use plastic bottles really more convenient? These bottles have to be produced, transported, consumed, and then disposed of. Many plastic bottles don't get recycled and sit in landfills or litter the ocean. Plastic takes thousands of years to decompose, so wherever it ends up, it stays for a very, very long time, or it's ingested by wildlife, and that isn't good for anyone. All of these steps require valuable energy and resources, like oil and even more water. Imagine a plastic bottle filled with one quarter oil. That's how much oil is needed for just one bottle of water. So bottled water lets you take it with you, but wait, so does a reusable water bottle. So is it really that much more convenient? In Guelph, anywhere you go, there is a tap that can give you the same water for free. So is the $2 really worth it? 78% of students who voted wanted administration to end the sale and distribution of bottled water on campus. But administration chose not to listen to the student voice, and instead they decided to go about business as usual and refused to take a proactive stance on waste at our university. Because of the student movement, more filtered water fountains have been put in around campus, but administration is still refusing to phase out the contracts and bottled water companies. If the contracts aren't phased out in the next few years, it would mean that a huge amount of bottled water would still have to be produced to be consumed and disposed of just for Guelph students. Ending the sale and distribution of bottled water would have a huge impact on demand for a wasteful product like this and send a strong message to the world about what we stand for at the University of Guelph. We don't want our university, which prides itself on being environmentally conscious, to continue supporting corporations and products that are negatively impacting our environment. The thing is, a ton of other Canadian schools have already ended the sale of bottled water on their campuses. It can be done, and it has been done, just not at the University of Guelph. So here's how to get involved. Join the bottled water free movement that's spreading across the nation. Use a reusable water bottle save on money, and reduce waste. Get involved at Guelph with the CSA's tap-in campaign for a bottled water free campus.